Hey family, it's your girl Trish. Welcome back to my channel for another video. So in today's video, this one's gonna be a little different because I will be showing you guys how I styled this wig. Um, I just wanted to bring you guys like another hair video. You guys know that I like to do my hair on here sometimes. And I wanted to bring you guys this bomb wig and it was only $38, y'all. Only $38. This wig is the Bobby Boss Boss Lace soft blowout natural texture wig and this is in the style jewels and i got it in the number one off with me and wigs i only do number one i don't really dive like straight off into colors and stuff that's just that's not me i stick with my number one but this is what the wig looks like um in the video i will show you guys all the details um in the of, in the wig um it does says that it's a 3.5 deep lace part i want to see how I laid this wig down, how I, um, just pretty much how I laid it down. It was very, very easy, y'all. It was very easy. And for me, I don't really get too much. Although I love wearing wigs, I'm not a professional when it comes to, like, putting on my wigs and stuff. So, yes, y'all guys, you guys will see how easy it was for me to put this wig on. So, if you guys want to see how I laid this wig down and how I slayed this wig, make sure to keep watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys want to see more content from me. And be sure to hit that notification bell so you guys are up notified every time I upload a new video. So let's get into it. Hey y'all, so welcome back for another video. So in today's video, I will be styling this wig. Um, this is the Bobby Boss unit in the Styles Jewels. As you guys can see, there is a just a lace going around the front. And it has two combs in the front as well and then one comb in the back. Right here, I am putting on the wig, so I'm going to be using my handy got to be spray, and I will be um, putting down two uh, layers of this spray to secure my wig down. And this is what I always do to secure my wigs. I don't use any type of glue. I just use the spray, and I keep it pushing. I was being lazy um, to go and get my blow dryer, so that's why I'm just using the um, the card that came with the unit to fan down uh, to dry down the glue. And now I'm just pulling the wig up front, and I'm just gonna tie my edge wrap my, my edge satin wrap to let this um, dry in place a little bit, and I will be right back. All right, so now that it ha that has set for a little bit, we're gonna go ahead and cut the lace. So I pulled it up a little bit, and I'm gonna start in the middle with cutting the lace just to make my life a little bit more easier. So y'all gonna see me go back a few times to cut like some extra lace that, I that needed to be cut initially that I did not cut. So yeah, that's what y'all gonna see me do. And thumbs up this video if you guys want to see more synthetic synthetic units for me. Right here, I'm just using some powder to blend in the lace a little bit with my skin so that it can be undetectable. So I'm just cutting, like I said, I'm just cutting away some extra lace that did not need to be there. I was trying my hardest not to like cut off the lace that was already kind of like glued down. So yeah. So now that that is done, we're, um, I'm going to be taking out my baby here so that I can go over the, um, the top part with my hot comb. Thank you. 
Now I'm using my little handy hot comb and I am just going to flatten out this unit so that that this uh wig is laying nice and flat. And I'm just going to use a little bit of mousse, not a lot, just a little bit just to help it lay, lay down even more flat. Because we don't want a bumpy unit. We do not want a bumpy unit. We want it to be flat, okay? We want it to be flat. So now I'm going to pin my hair out my way and I'm just going to cut my baby hairs so we can go ahead and lay these baby hairs down. I don't get too crazy with my baby hairs. Do my little one, two, three swoops and I call it a day. I don't like my baby hairs too thick. I like them to look natural. So yeah, that's what I do with my own baby hairs. Nothing too fancy. Yeah, I be focusing so hard <laughs> when I be doing my hair. I be focusing so hard. The faces I make, but it's okay, girl. It's okay. Because once I am done with this unit, I ain't going to be looking like that. I'm going to be looking cute, okay? I'm going to be looking real cute. See, look at that. Nothing too fancy. Simple, but yet still cute and effective. You ain't got to do all of that. To each his own, but like I said, you don't have to do all of that. Now I'm just gonna take my little scarf again, and we're gonna, I'm gonna tie my baby hairs down so that it can set a little bit, and I'll be back to show you guys the rest of my styling process. Yes, sis. F uh, uh, face is beat. Hair is done. I'm just combing it out a little bit. And that's it for this video, you guys. I will see you guys in my outro. All right, y'all. So this is the finished look. I did not expect to like this wig as much as I do. I love how natural it looks. The, the luster on like the shine on it is not too much but it, it still has a little shine but it's not too like much it looks natural it doesn't even look like a synthetic wig it doesn't feel like no synthetic wig um only has like the lace that goes across so it says on here that it's a 3.5 deep lace part so that's right here but it going across the lace is not that much but it's not like like it, it doesn't I don't, I don't know the word I'm looking for, but it's just not like a lot of lace to cut around, but it was okay. And this is, it claims to be a soft blowout uh, wig, natural texture. And like I said, it doesn't even look synthetic. It doesn't feel synthetic. It feels like natural, like relaxed hair. And it's a middle part wig. It has these nice body, um, these nice uh, like waves. It's like a body wave. Uh, length of a body wave type curl in the um, wig really really nice you can add some more curls if you want to it does says it does say that this is um uh, safe heat styling or whatever um but i for me i didn't add any heat the only heat that i added was up here when i used my hot comb to flatten the wig down a little bit um i did add a little bit of powder here in the part just to make it um match my uh, make it look natural to match my complexion but other than that, I did not have to do much with this wig. This wig is really, really nice. I could wear this every day if I wanted to. I really, really love this wig, y'all. I really love, really love the way it frames my face and everything. I love, I do love middle parts on me. So, yeah. But let me know down in the comment section if you guys want to see more synthetic wigs from me. Make sure to like this video as well if you guys want to see more synthetic wigs from me. Um, but be sure to subscribe to my channel. So you guys are not missing out on my videos and I will see you guys in my next video.